Hello everyone, in this tutorial I want to show you how you can design and 3D print your own eyeglasses frames. If you're somebody who wears prescription glasses on a regular basis, there's a number of reasons why you may want to do this. Perhaps your frames are already damaged beyond repair or you simply want to have an emergency pair in case something happens. Whatever the reason may be, 3D printing your frames will provide some significant cost benefits in terms of materials and also save you that expensive visit to the eye clinic. But before I walk you through the process of designing and manufacturing your frames, let's go over some of the basics. If you already own a 3D printer at home, you're gonna need some filament. For this project, I recommend using polylactic acid filament, also known as PLA, due to its good tensile strength and biodegradable properties. To actually 3D print my parts, I'll be using the Creality CR10S, which has a working print area of 30 by 30 cm and a print volume height of 40 cm. For our intents and purposes, any printer with similar build volume will be more than sufficient. For basic tools, you'll need a pair of wire cutters and pliers to remove any excess material, sandpaper to smooth out the rough surfaces and sharp edges, measuring tape or even better, a digital caliper if you can buy one to get accurate measurements of your eyepieces, a set of small allen keys and screwdrivers, some form of self-adhesive paper to map the contour of your eyepieces, which we'll use as a reference to generate our 3D models, and finally, a pair of screws to fasten the foldable legs onto the main frame. For my design, I'm using 2.4mm diameter socket screws. To generate my 3D models, I'll be using PTC Creo, formerly known as Pro Engineer, but you can use any other CAD modeling software such as SOLIDWORKS, CATIA or NX, depending on which one you feel the most comfortable with. So now that you know what type of software and tools you need for this project, let's go over the process of designing and building your parts. The first thing you need to do is removing the eyepiece from the frame. In my case, this was fairly easy to do since my eyeglasses were already falling apart. Next, you're gonna carefully draw the contour of the eyepiece onto the adhesive paper, which is gonna be used as a reference for 3D modeling or parts. Cut the section using a pair of scissors or X-Acto knife and paste it temporarily on top of the lens to block the transparency of the glass. Make sure there are no air pockets trapped on the surface or along the edges. At this point, take measurements of the outermost width and length of the reference eyepiece and note down which side of the frame it corresponds to. For the next step, you will take a scan of your eyepiece, which we will use as a template during 3D modeling. You can also take a photo with your phone, but this is a more accurate method. Once you're done scanning, open your CAD modeling software and import your scanned image. Align the origin of the lens with the reference frame of your new part, so we can design around it. To model the contour of the lens, I sketched a spline connected by multiple dots. This allowed me to dynamically reshape it later to adjust any design imperfections. I then extruded the solid part as a shell with a wall thickness of 3mm. Keep in mind that even though PLA has good mechanical strength, it will absolutely break if you make your frames too thin, but you don't want them too thick either as they could block your field of view. I also approximated the curvature of the lens as a spline and completed the first half section of my eyeglasses. At this point, I decided to 3D print a test piece. I recommend you do this as well to ensure you can easily pressure fit the eyepiece inside the frames. During this test, I actually found out that my design tolerances were a bit off, so I went back to my sketch and made some slight modifications. The total time it took to design and adjust all the parts, including the frame, legs, and adding mounting holes and other details was about 10 hours. When I was finally happy with my design, I exported the parts to my machine for printing. Total print time was less than 2 hours and the parts came out quite nicely. Post-processing the PLA parts involved removing the support material using my pair of cutters and pliers, and sanding the rough surfaces for added smoothness. I then completed the frame assembly with a pair of screws and installed both eyepieces. I have to say, I wasn't really expecting it to work quite well, but I was satisfied with the end product. So there you have it guys, that's how you can design and 3D print your own eyeglasses frames at home. I hope you found this tutorial useful and if you decide to make your own shades, please let me know. I would love to see your results and discuss any challenges that you encounter. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.